What's up guys? Today we're going Super Saiyan. We're checking out my Dragon Ball Z Funko Pop collection. And this is really crazy because special announcement. My eBay store is up. Go Carlo underscore collectibles. In this video, we're basically dropping the first wave. The first time you'll ever see me dropping a whole wave of stuff onto eBay where I'm putting a piece of my collection up for sale not because I even want to sell it the real reason I'm doing this is because all of my friends who have been following me for a long time you guys get to have the chance to own a piece of my collection so when you look at this Funko Pop in your new collection you know you'll remember that that pop actually came from me you guys can always remember me when you have that funko pop in your collection seriously guys leave a like on this video write a comment let me know if you're surprised check out my ebay store go carlo underscore collectibles and browse it it'll be a really cool place to browse just to see awesome collectibles but for now i thought i would put all my dragon ball z funko pops up on my ebay store to uh to test things out right now let's get started checking out my collection that i've built up over the years all right so remember everyone we're gonna try and do this in order this is number 10 for animation when it comes to funko pops boom we have vegeta Prince Vegeta. This is the first wave of Dragon Ball Z Funko Pops, but we're gonna show you the rest of my Dragon Ball Z Funko Pop collection uh, in order that uh, they were made. So here's Vegeta, the earliest one. Um, that's actually really crazy to think about. Actually, now that I think about it, this pop that I'm holding in my hands that's in this video is gonna go to somebody's collection. That is really cool to think about one more thing I want to say about that um, before I continue and I'm just going to talk about Funko Pops is for all of my followers, you guys are kind of getting your the first chance, the first dibs on these Funko Pops. So I will be giving good deals. I can't do outrageous prices or else they won't sell. So I really will be giving deals on certain things. So if, if you uh, check out my store, you will find some deals but this was the first Funko Pop that we got to check out we're gonna check out the rest so here is the next one that we're looking at this is final form Frieza have they done more Frieza pops I actually don't know but this pop is just so classic oh my god this is number 12 for animation when it comes to Funko Pops it was a part of the first wave of Dragon Ball Z Funko Pops and it's just such a clean figure I really like the look of it final form Frieza alright guys so the next Dragon Ball Z Funko Pop is Super Saiyan Goku and this is actually glow in the dark this was an entertainment earth exclusive this was a part of the first wave of Dragon Ball Z Funkos and I really like the look of this Funko. This is this is a classic figure, especially for Pops. When you think of Pops, you, you think of this. This is a classic design. The next Pop, remember, we're going in order, is Gohan. So this is Gohan, how you see him in the, in the first episode of the series, you know. He's got this little outfit that's so memorable. Wow, when you look at this pop from the side, he even has a ponytail and his uh, monkey tail. This is a part of the second wave of Dragon Ball Z Funko Pop figures. All right, guys, so the next pop here is Trunks. Everybody's favorite. Don't even get me started why, man. You guys know he's the boy from the future, traveled to the past. If you ask me who's the coolest Dragon Ball Z character, like, I mean... Cool future trunks. All right, guys. So the next pop here, everybody's favorite. It's Goku's best friend, Krillin. Check it out, guys. Krillin. This is another pop in the second wave of figures. Next pop 
that we take a look at is going to be the end of wave two. Here it is, guys. The big boy Majin Buu. Majin Buu, guys. Man, this is a heavy pop. This is a big one. Not going to lie. This box is, uh, is acceptable. Last pop was number 111. And now we have 121. This is Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan Goku. Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan Goku from Resurrection F. This is a part of the series that Beerus is in. But yeah, this figure is really cool. The Super Saiyan Goku figures always look awesome. This one, I was really happy to get. I remember when I got it. This is Super Saiyan Vegeta. We've kind of been going in order, almost, uh, of the series. Uh, we skipped around a little bit, but... Yeah, here we have it. We, we haven't seen a Super Saiyan Vegeta yet. Now we have a Super Saiyan Vegeta. Yeah, this is where the waves and everything get crazy. This is a exclusive. Um, hopefully, I don't know if I've been pointing that out for some of them, but you guys will catch it on your own. But yeah, this was actually an exclusive. It has a little bit of wear here on the um, on the window, but really awesome pop. All right, guys, here we have more trunks. Not gonna lie, this was actually one of my favorite pops ever. This is Super Saiyan Trunks. Trunks has one of the coolest Super Saiyan forms. His hair goes so cool when he's Super Saiyan. This was actually a New York Comic Con exclusive from 2016 2016 wow wow both of these pops here actually share the same number but i don't think that they share the same value one of these has to be rarer than the other here we have the metallic blue hair super saiyan god super saiyan vegeta ssg ss vegeta from dragon ball super wearing the cool uh, Whis armor. And here we have the regular hair version. Depends which one you like better. If you wanted to go with the rest of your collection, if you want the rare variant. These are really stylish. These are really, really stylish Funko Pops. Guys, not gonna lie, we're getting close. We're almost done checking out the whole collection. Here, we saw, we saw some Vegeta, and now we're gonna see more Vegeta. This is more Dragon Ball Super Vegeta. Wearing his Whis armor, but this is base Vegeta this time. No Super Saiyan. All right, guys. I know you guys are going to like this one. I know you guys are going to like this one. Bad Man Vegeta. We call him that because that's what the shirt says. This is actually during a really cool scene where they're waiting for Goku to arrive on Earth. And the suspense is real. I remember watching that episode when I was young. And they're all just hanging out in a... In kind of like the Grand Canyon and if you haven't seen it you gotta see what happens next guys we are really we are really almost done this is the second to last pop I have to show you but it's one of my favorites this is Whis this is Whis not gonna lie I think this pop is actually kind of sought after and we're starting to see this is where it gets into Dragon Ball Super um, for the Funko Pops this series has a lot of pops that I don't have. Hit is in there. I wish I had that one. Future Trunks, Zamatsu. But this pop is really awesome, guys. Whis from Dragon Ball Super. This is actually one of the newer uh, Funko Pops. One thing I did notice is because this one is going back to the original Dragon Ball, up top it says uh, Dragon Ball compared to this one. It says Dragon Ball Super. And some of the other ones even say Dragon Ball Z. Even when you flip it over, it has the original Dragon Ball uh, pops because I guess it's a part of the same series. But this is Master Pilaf, the original villain of Dragon Ball, especially in the beginning. But seriously, thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much, guys, for checking out my whole Funko Pop collection. This is something that I wanted to do for a long time, just talk about my Funko Pops and my Funko Pop collection. But in this video, I'm gonna do something different. You know, I'm gonna be putting my Funko Pops up on my eBay 
uh, page, Go Carlo Collectibles, and please check it out, guys. It'll be really fun uh, to browse just to see what kind of cool stuff I have in my collection. Uh, maybe some stuff that you never knew about before that you'll be able to see. And the reason why I'm doing this is just to give back to you guys, you know. Um, so you guys can have a piece of my collection. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching this video. Again, leave a like, subscribe, write a comment, check out the Twitch channel, and please check out my eBay page now, my eBay store. Check out the rest of my videos on my channel, guys. Until next time, I really hope that you guys get a chance uh, to grab one of these pops. Uh, doesn't matter which one it is, you got plenty to choose from. And if you don't get a chance to get any of these, uh, I might do it again with uh, something else. You know, maybe I'll get more Dragon Ball pops in the future. Maybe some other anime stuff. Maybe some Naruto. Maybe uh, some Star Wars. Maybe it won't even be Funko Pop related. Maybe it would be something completely different. But thank you so much, everyone. Until next time.